Hi, um, I'm Kwong, I sing Chu, and this is Rachel. Um, I often hear about how expensive it is shopping at Brian Patch. And yes, organics, non GMO, uh, locally sourced do cost more. And uh, like Richard was saying, Sierra Harvest is a saying at Sierra Harvest one of the many organizations that we support and work with, you either pay now or you pay later. So, but I digress, it's a good point, but I digressed. Um, what speaks to me most about this issue is actually the local food supply. And I mean access, access to good local food. And it, it involves availability, and also cost. Like I first talked about the expensive um, journey at uh, shopping at Briar Patch. Now, the board, we are very concerned about these issues because we are shoppers ourselves too. And we are fully committed to trying to address this issue. Now, we think being a multi store outfit will greatly improve availability and cost. How? Well, being bigger increases our physical footprint. We've got more space and more room, so we'll be more available. Being bigger also increases our buying volume, thereby improving prices. Now you, you buy, buy in bulk at Costco or wherever, it's usually a little uh, economies of scale and all that. Being a multi-store entity improves our buying and selling ability so we can offer more and we can also expand our variety. We will also be able to buy more from local and other sources, thus stabilizing our supply chain. And obviously expand our operations like Mark was saying, through economies of scale and shared resources, we will also be expected to lower prices. So in short, we think being a multi-unit store entity will help us, one, improve availability, two, lower cost, three, increase our range and variety, and four, we will be able to strengthen our supply chain. And now I'll hand it over to Rachel Allen. So as we wrap up tonight, um, there's one more point I want to share. It's something that I'm really excited about uh, as we explore this idea of um, a multi-store strategy. And that's the impact that we're going to have on the local food system and our local farmers. And I want to take a moment to really underline this point. Um, Briar Patch has been the only regional grocer that has really invested the time and the energy to build relationships with their local farmers, to get to know them, to organize them, so they can maximize the amount of local food. Yes! No other store has done that. And um, that's really created not only the abundance for us as consumers, but it's created a reliable market for a lot of our farmers. A lot of our new farmers and our established farmers, um, because of the Briar Patch, they're able to move forward and to be successful. So, uh, we like the idea of local farms, but I really want to underline we are truly benefiting when our local farms are benefiting. Um, we have access to the great, high quality, fresh, organic food. We're building community resilience by having more local food in our food system. We're helping promote or we're helping preserve our local agricultural lands. And we've got people who are farming it with techniques that are actually building ecological health into our environments. And we're keeping more of our food dollars in our local food economy. So everybody wins when our farmers win. Um, last year as a community, we purchased about $6 million in produce from the Briar Patch. for me to imagine with multiple stores um, the stability, the security, and the growth that we can create for our local food community.